This is Shimon the Digger, and you are listening to the PWA Show. I'm not your typical American. I'm not your All right, Corey, we are doing a video commentary this week, as we talked about on our mm-hmm. most recent episode. Barack mm-hmm. Obama made a big announcement this week, and we know this guy is a speaker among speakers. He's great. One of the best I've ever heard. Uh, so we're going to play a drinking game. Uh, okay. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, I think he says uh a little bit. So uh? what we're going to do every time he mm. says uh, we're going to play a ding. <laughs> That's funny, dude. If you're playing at home. <laughs> every time you say uh and a ding, yeah, take a drink. Take a drink. So uh, here we go. Uh, did you start it? Uh, no. Um, oh. I've always been adamant that uh, gay and lesbian uh, Americans should be treated fairly That's three. and equally. What? What are you doing? Uh, and that's why, in addition over. to everything we've done in this administration, rolling back, don't ask, don't tell, uh, uh, so that uh, you know outstanding that was Americans what he did. can uh, serve uh, our country. I'm too pressurized uh, here. <laughs> no longer defending the I'm Defense it. Against Marriage Act, which uh, tried to federalize uh, what has historically been state law. Uh, I've stood on the side of broader <laughs> equality for uh, the LGBT community. Um, uh. And I had hesitated on gay marriage, uh, in part because I thought civil unions would be sufficient, that that was something that would give people hospital visitation rights and uh, other uh, elements that we take for granted. Uh, Why do you guys think this guy's a great speaker? uh, I was sensitive to the fact that uh, for a lot of people, the the word marriage was something that evokes very powerful traditions, <laughs> sure. religious beliefs, and so did. Um, But I have to tell you that this, over the course of... If I was interviewing this guy, I'd be like, dude. Uh, several years, as I talk to... I don't even know what we're at right now. ...friends and family and neighbors, uh, when I think about uh, <laughs> members of my own staff who are... Are you guys drunk ...incredibly yet? committed monogamous relationships, same-sex relationships, who are raising kids together. Uh, when I think about uh, those... Soldiers or airmen or Marines. This is or, ridiculous. We're uh, in the double digits. Sailors who are oh, yeah. out there How fighting on my behalf uh, uh, and yet feel constrained. We even still got. Now that Don't Ask, Don't Tell is gone because. I don't even know, uh, man. Like they're two not minutes able to, left. Uh, did it again. Ding. Commit themselves in a marriage. <laughs> uh, at a certain point, I've just concluded <laughs> Keep that. Keep drinking, man. Uh, for me personally. So there you go. That's our great is, uh, speaker. Uh. I don't even know what to say about that. See, I keep now. I keep just no. Going, uh, see, see, there's gonna be a whole generation of little kids named Obama running around saying, "Uh." So that's it. That's our great. It's our great American speaker. What? See, people seriously think that guy is great. I think he's speaker. awesome. I mean, really seriously. Why has no one called him out on this? Hey, we should play. We should end this right here, and then we'll have a follow-up drinking game, and we're gonna play the one where his um. What do you call the, the crawlers? What do you call the the, the prompter? His prompter oh, yeah. goes out in two thousand eight when he's running for president. His prompter. You want it? Let's play that next. All right. Whatever you say, man. Drinking game will continue. I'm Barack Obama, and I approve this message.